Wonderful act, Russ Stevens. Now, these birds are very cooperative, aren't they? How yes. do you make them su such good companions in your act? Well, it, it takes quite a lot of training, actually. Probably yeah. about six months. As long as that? Yeah. What quite, do you have to do? Um, well, you have to, without giving any secrets away. <laughs> yes, I'm, I know yeah. you won't do that. You have to mainly teach them not to actually fly away when, when you produce them. But mm -hmm. uh, the wings aren't clipped. A lot of people think that magicians probably clip the bird's wings, but they, they can fly away if they, if they really want to. But uh, they're basically like pets, so they don't really feel the need, I don't think. Now, you, you're handling it either. We, could I handle it, or would it take off? Yeah, right sure. It's it fine. Yeah, now, to get them to, do, to flap the wings, you have to move That's one it. hand behind the other like this. And yep. then, and it's very, but now, this bird is obviously in very good condition. There are some people who would say it was cruel to, to use birds in a trick like this, but it's not, is it? No, no, no way at all. These are pets. I mean, in a way, they're, they're better off than in being in a pet shop. I mean, they're, they're well fed, and as you can see, they're, they're really well kept yes. as well. What's this one called? Horace. How many do you have altogether? Um, I have six altogether, but I only use three yeah, yeah. in my act only I'd two today. I'd love to ask you how you do it, but I know you wouldn't tell me. No. But um, quite clearly, before the birds appear, they're, 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 they're very quiet there for yeah. a moment. And uh, so they must, in fact, be quite relaxed. It, it doesn't distress them at all. No, no. I mean, as you can see, he's really relaxed now. Yes, he is yes. used to the, to the, uh, the lights and, yeah. and everything. But, uh, they're, they're just trained, and they're very docile birds anyway. They're, they're really Why nice. doves? I think because they're docile, and they're very friendly birds. I used to use a, a parrot in my act, and <laughs> yeah, they you were a bit more troublesome. <laughs> yeah, yeah, quite a few times, actually. <laughs> I won't ask where, because then we know where you were hiding it. That's but right. Do you look upon them as pets now? I mean, do, you, do, you, do they become friends of yours, or are they simply working companions? No, no, companions? they're to totally pets, totally, as well as the fact that I work with them. But I mean, I had an interest in birds before, so my, my father used to race pigeons and breed them as well. Aha, uh -huh. so, so it's, it's a family tradition. Do you lose many of them? In, in, have you ever lost one? No, none, never. Sometimes they'll fly away. They fly, they fly off, but they only fly probably a few, a few feet and perch somewhere. I suppose if I just lower my hand, the wings will... Yes, That's you, it. But it's still not flying now. That's right, it? yeah. <laughs> Russ Stevens, thank you very much for showing us a very exciting act. Thank you.